here. So as you guys requested, here I am making the airplane video. Got to adjust my new mic a little bit. Oh yeah. <laughs> um, so, and I'm trying to include like gas mileage kind of this time, but yeah. And there's there's not that many airplanes, so we included the gyro, which I'll get to why it's not an airplane later, guys. I know. So many comments about that. <laughs> you did it included in the helicopters. I know I did it on purpose. Um, and I also used included the rainbow hatchback as a plane too. Just some like random vehicles that don't really fit in anywhere. Cause this is like a chitty chitty bang bang car up in there. Like that's not a plane. <laughs> All right, let's get right into it. Um, let's see here. So first we have the sandpiper, um, which has a speed of 107, seats two. So it's not good for large groups. Uh, oh, I should explain gas and time real quick. So I what I did is I flew from uh let's see if you can see it yeah those plates right there so like i flew from right here to right here so point a to point b maybe i'll maybe i'll do some editing on this maybe i won't probably not let's be honest okay this is point a i flew it to point b and i took the time down i'm um, actually flew straight to this intersection so that i knew where to stop and i took the time down and how much gas it used um, and it seems like for all these guys to go 107 miles per hour, it's pretty much the same. I think it's just like altitude errors and stuff like that because I can't really control my altitude. So I think some with some of the planes I flew higher, some I flew lower. So the uh, the time and gas are different, but I think they should be identical. So yeah. So anyway, so yeah, gas it took 18 to get from point A to point B. It took one minute 13 seconds to get there. This vehicle is not armored. You can knife it. And uh, the controls are great. It is very maneuverable, very easy to use. Um, and then we have um, the Otter, which is pretty much the Sandpiper, except it can do water landings. It goes 107 miles per hour. Okay, all the stats are pretty much the same. <laughs> Let's just go through this. Uh, it is not armored. Uh, the controls are very good, just like the uh, uh, Sandpiper. But the, yeah, the beauty of this otter is that you can do water landings, but you can also take off from um, any any type of ground or anything like that, which is strange. All right, and then we have a really, really special one, one that is unobtainable in the game in vanilla. However, on a lot of the shop servers, you can buy them. They're usually pretty expensive. But yeah, it's a flying car. Chitty, chitty, bang, bang. Um, it is not armored. It goes 107 miles per hour. It seats four. Um, it took 20 gas to get from point A to point B and it took 1 minute 11 seconds. Yep, yep. And the controls are great. It is actually probably more maneuverable than those two, but it's also very fragile. Like sometimes if you even go up like a lip like this, the whole car will explode. So <laughs> be careful with that one. All right, next we have this beast. <laughs> uh, so this is one of my favorites. This is the Anushka. And it goes 107 miles per hour, which is the same as all these. Seat 7, which is great for large crews. Took 17 gas to get there. Could just be error. Um, took 11, or 1 minute 13 seconds to get there. It is armored, but it is kind of clunky. The controls are poor, but it is relatively easy to fly as long as you have large spaces. It's just hard to, to land in small spaces because it's not very maneuverable. So you have to plan very far ahead. Um, like long before you get to the runway, if it's a short runway. Um, but the beauty of this guy is he's relatively hard to um, explode. <laughs> so I, one thing you guys should know is that with the helicopters, it seems like when the the helicopter blades on top hit something, that's when it explodes. And it seems with the, the planes and things, um, it's this rotor on the front. When that hits something, it explodes. So you can smack these wings into the trees or whatever you want, and your vehicle will be fine. But the second you hit this rotor that's on the front, the whole thing explodes. So uh, that's what makes planes a little bit easier to fly than, than helicopters. They're more forgiving. All right, so next we have the all-time best plane, the fighter jet. <laughs> uh, so it's only available on Russia through the quest line, as far as I know. It goes at amazing speeds of 161 miles per hour. It seats one. It has 21, uh, or it took 21 gas to uh, get from point A to point B, and it only took 46 seconds. That is fast, my friends. It is armored, has good controls. However, sometimes it is hard to control because you go at such high speeds. And now 
shoots from the driver's seat. Look, okay. this is the best part of the whole thing. This is the only vehicle, as far as I know, in Unturned that shoots from the driver's seat. It's pretty awesome. It just takes HMG boxes, as you guys might expect. So you can just fill that with uh, low-cal military ammo. Um, but anyway, yep, that's pretty much it for that guy. And here's another beast, however, it is only available on Hawaii as far as I know. It goes 107 miles per hour, it seats 8, so it's the highest um, capacity airplane or vehicle period, except for the bus maybe. Yeah, except for the bus. It's the highest capacity airplane for sure in the game. Um, it took 18 gas to get from point A to point B, it took 1 minute 13 seconds. It is armored, the controls are poor, it's just like the, uh, the Anushka, uh, where it's very bulky but um, relatively easy to fly as long as you don't have to land in a, um, a very tight space. And as you guys can tell here, we don't make contact with the plane when we stab at it, which is interesting. Um, that looks like a little bug that Nelson didn't notice, I guess. Because every other type you can hit the metal. Um, and then the same thing with the gyro. Oh, the gyro. Yeah, the gyro doesn't make sound, but you get hit markers because you can destroy it. So these two vehicles are the only vehicles that I've ever seen that don't make a sound when you hit them with a knife. Um, anyway, okay, where were we? So yeah, it holds eight. Um, it, it, just like the Otter, it's good for water landings. So yeah, that's pretty amazing. And it can take off and land on land as well. Uh, but it is in Hawaii only, which sucks. <laughs> All right, and lastly, we have the Gyro which is not a helicopter and is not a plane. I'll explain to you guys why here. So the reason it's not a, a helicopter is because a helicopter has um, helicopter blades on, or it has blades on top, just like the gyro does. However, the blades must be powered for it to be considered a helicopter because um, the helicopter generates its lift from, or like, okay, so they both generate their lift from the, the blades on top, but the difference is that um, it's not powered on the gyro where it is on the helicopter so that makes it not a helicopter <laughs> and then why is it not a plane uh, so oh, okay I should explain a little bit more so this uh, this rotor on the back uh, what it does is it provides um, horizontal um, what is it called horizontal power no, I don't know uh, but it, it makes it move horizontally is what I'm trying to say and then as it moves horizontally um, This starts spinning which creates lift so The lift is created by this going getting spinning from the horizontal power being put from the uh, the rotor back here and so that makes it not a plane also because a plane uses wings um, for a lift Yeah but yeah, it's not considered a plane, it's not considered a helicopter. Look it up if you don't believe me. I didn't explain that very well. But let's go right into it. So it has a really slow speed of 62. It only seats one. I don't know why people keep saying it's OP. Like guys, it goes 62 miles per hour and it's it can be shot down with like 10 bullets probably. Like I don't understand why you think it's so OP. It is craftable though, which is cool. Um, so it took me 347 gas, that's not right. Uh, it took me 37 gas uh, in 2 minutes 33 seconds to get from point A to point B. It is not armored. Um, the controls are responsive but strange, as I'll show you guys in a second. It is craftable, but it can only be crafted on Hawaii. Alright, and the beauty of this guy is that you can smash into pretty much anything. It doesn't matter. Like, seriously. You can jam your whole helicopter into, like, a building. Oh my god. We're glitching into the floor, guys. <laughs> what the heck? We're like partially in the floor. Screw this. <laughs> We're moving our side. Alright. So yeah, it kind of takes off like an airplane, but much quicker. And you can do like all sorts of aerial stuff. And it's like hard to get back down to the ground kind of. But you can for sure just like jam it into stuff. 
and it'll take damage like a normal vehicle, but it won't blow up. Like if that was a helicopter and the rotors hit something, that would have exploded like immediately. And yeah, once you get going doing spinnies, like it's insane. It's giving me a headache. Is it giving you guys a headache? Uh, uh are we getting are we gaining like speed? Are we going faster and faster? Oh my god, I gotta look away. Ah! <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, we hit sky limit. See, if you just keep hitting the gas, it just goes forever. It just like keeps going up and up. Like, what the heck? And then it's like really hard to get back down. And you can fly it upside down. See, how uh, we're trying to get back down, but I can't. Now we're we're gonna die. Ha! Let me down. Oh my God! <laughs> Rip us! All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, so pretty much, if you're looking for a vehicle or a helicopter that lands on water, look for the Otter or the um, the Coast Guard seaplane. If you happen to be on, uh, wait, did I say Hawaii? I meant. Oh, no, it is Hawaii, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hawaii for the Coast Guard stuff. Um, so yeah. Coast Guard seaplane or the Otter for stuff that can land on water. Uh, high capacity vehicles, Coast Guard seaplane and Anushka, which hold seven and eight, or I guess eight and seven respectively. Um, let's see, what else do I have to say? Fighter jet obviously is going to be the fastest and it shoots, which is awesome. However, it's a quest item and it probably takes hours and hours to get. Uh, I'll probably end up doing that in my vanilla series, which is going to be coming out pretty soon. I have three episodes recorded so far, but I probably won't start releasing them until I have like 10 or so. Just so that my base doesn't get raided before I get some videos out. Um, that's pretty much it. Guys, uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, click that like button. And if you really enjoyed it, click that subscription button. Oh yeah. And also, what, what vehicles would you guys like me to do next? Would you like me to do boats? Would you like me to do... I don't know. What, what guide videos do you want me to do? Like really delve into something just tell me what it is and i'll i'll consider doing it if it gets a lot of likes all right talk to you guys later bye, -bye.